this is Nick from 88 Espresso Premium Blend. Please enjoy this video series on how to become a better barista at home. Hi, uh, it's Nick here from 88 Espresso. Uh, welcome back to uh, uh, another little uh, episode or video on, um, on, on, on coffee. So today we want to talk about uh, grinds and uh, just when ground or what sort of grind and what it needs to look like for what sort of machine that you're going to use. So basically I've made up a little, uh, a little sample plate of commercial espresso, home espresso, stovetop filter, like drip filter, and plunger, like French press plunging down with it. So all of these grinds have different um, coarseness or fineness to them um, based on, on, on the equipment you use and the pressure that's required to push through to get the extraction and get the oil out of the coffee and the grind that you've um, that you've done. So commercial uh, espresso in my mind is a little bit like icing sugar, probably not as fine as icing sugar, but um, that sort of fineness where it's quite sticky and, and holds together. Uh, we have um, a photo of each of these, which we can probably work out and put somewhere if, we, if you're interested. Um, the home espresso, because the pressure on, this is full commercial, so with a home one, there's not as much pressure and, and, and the process a little bit slower. So we don't want it to be bogged up um, in fine coffee. So we make that slightly coarser, which then I would probably refer that to sort of caster sugar or a little bit coarser than that. Um, then we go to stovetop um, cafeteria like uh, uh, and filter, filter coffee. There we're going to sort of like a white sugar um, or a little bit coarser than a white sugar. Hello, somebody wants some coffee from 88 Espresso Premium Blend. Um, and then we go to plunger, and plunger's quite coarse, a bit like raw sugar. So they're the basic four. If you were thinking about how do I want to grind this and I need to do this, that's basically, I suppose, a guideline for it. It's not necessarily correct, but it's, it's for the home barista, it's probably a really, really good start until you start to sort of refine your skills in that area. Thanks very much.